little different here. This one we got an Oldsmobile Cutlass Sierra SL. It is a like baby light blue. A little bit of rust around the front fender. A lot of bit of rust around the rear. But thicker metal, that's for sure. So it took a lot more to completely blow out. So you put a couple layers of Bondo on it before it was completely gone, right? Ha 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 ha. A lot of this crap here on her, or it's sitting in some sort of, it's sitting in like cattails. That's a cattail, that's what it is. So it's sitting in a swampy weeds or something. Um, body's pretty straight though. I'm just, honestly, the paint's in really good shape too. I don't know if it, what happened here? It's in, like headlights are in good shape. It is a straight car. I don't see a dent in it, just rust. So, it was driven and taken care of. How about that? Driven nicely. Like, none of the lights are busted out of it. The fuel tank's in the trunk. Like, look at that deck lid. This has never seen hail either. Look at that roof. And it had to have been garage kept too because it's, the clear coat's not coming off for I don't know, 90s at least, right? Looks like it was being driven recently too. Oh no. Randwin Park sort of thing here. Oh, well, we're missing some stuff under there. Anyway, it looks like, yeah, I mean, their pads are war, but it looks like it was driven. Oh no. It's gonna be one of those grandma or grandpa passed away and we're throwing their 30 year old car away that they just drove to the grocery store last week. Oh, well, let's look inside, let's see what we got for. Ooh, that door opens nice. Um, keys. It looks like we got blue interior to match. Headliner down, but it it's all right. It's down evenly. Put it that way. It looks okay. Uh, yeah, like a blue bench bucket sort of thing. Rear seats are a little dirty. Looks like they had animals, dog or something. Um, I've got a GM key and I've got an Ace hardware key. Um, Bob Grimm Buick GMC. It doesn't tell you where. I'm not going to look it up. We've got lots of blue. I see power locks, power windows. We've got only 108,110.3 miles. Looks like it had 103,000 in July of 21. So they have put 5,000 miles on it since July of 21. So 5,000 miles in two years. Not very heavily driven. I'm looking for like a sticker or something oh so I got seat belts in the door that's cool um, I'm upside down here am I blind? 5 and 95 so that's a very end of the year 95 Buick or not Buick Oldsmobile Cutlass um, what do we got here so it's just a no tack so we just got fuel tamp and mileage and then we've got a obviously your park your reverse drive it looks like this one is an overdrive model um let's put these keys in there fire this thing up real quick yeah right anyway unlock the steering we'll leave them there for the next guy isn't that fun pretty sure i just heard the uh um the clock spring snap my bad guys but I had, to, I had to do that. That's fun. Look at it shake the whole car. Uh, anyway, this is what it got. Oh, that's broke there. That was your cigarette lighter thing. Ashtray. Ooh. Owner's manual in the glove box. Yep, 95 olds. Okay. Now it won't shut. Whatever. Manual seats, I just bashed my head on that. It's tilt steering wheel. Oh, it's got cruise. Parky brake. Hood pop, that's what I wanted to do while I was up here. Yeah. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh, crash door opener. Garage kept. 
Told you. So, at 108,000 miles, I can see what has occurred here. So, okay, there's our hood latch, but uh, ain't nothing left under here. They took the engine, they took the transmission. So, yeah, at 108,000 miles, I'd say that's worth it. What is this? Was this probably what, like a. I don't know what would be under here. Sure. Uh, 20, that's a 16 for something, so some sort of inspection sticker. Maybe. Anyway, a pretty, pretty clean car. It's not like clean as in like there's no dance on it. The doors are in good shape, so I see a scratch there, but that's, what are the odds that's fresh? You know, because there is not a single dent in the rest of this car. It's just rust. And like the hood's good, you know, whole front grill's good. It's just your fenders and your rear quarters, you know, your trunk, all your doors look good. Clean car. Very, very nice car. I'd drive it.